In this video, I want to show you something that not many people know about. And that is that if you're using a custom image, you are breaking the secure socket layer on the PayPal purchase screen. Okay, now notice that there is nothing here indicating this is secure. Normally, you'd get a verified by VeriSign here, and you would also have a green banner or a different color banner here, it might be blue. Okay, and we're not seeing that. So what we need to do is go and fix that. Okay, so first of all, let's save this image onto our computer somewhere. If you don't already have it saved. Okay, then we want to go to a site called SSL Pick, SSLPick.com. Let's grab this picture from our computer. Okay, now make sure it is following these standards here. So a Jeff or a JPEG, not more than 50 kilobytes, width not more than 750 pixels, and height not more than 90 pixels. So make sure you're following those guidelines. You can find that out just by going to your picture here, going to properties, then go to details, and you'll see here we're 750 by 90, and under general we're 23.2 kilobytes. So we're within those parameters. Put your email address in here because the image link is going to go to you there and then put in the capture information and upload the image okay and then it says here your image has been uploaded and the link has been emailed to you so you need to go and collect that link now okay so i clicked on the link in the email i got now just in the browser bar up here i'm going to copy the link now you need to go into your paypal account and you need to update the link okay so what you need to do is log in and go to my selling tools and then you need to go to custom payment pages click update okay and then you'll have any in here now you would be updating since you have already a custom image that you need to change so this is the one I need to update here so let's change it okay and then all we need to do is go to where this link is the header image URL and paste in the secure, secure URL that we just got and save. Now that's it. We'll log out and then we're going to go back to our shopping cart and test it out. Okay and as you can see now we are secure. We have the verified by VeriSign. It's turned green here and we know that our SSL or secure socket layer is now working and people can be confident that when they purchase from us that their data is secure when it goes through PayPal. 